all time. Do you believe so? Do you, no, can I listen? Do you believe that? Do you believe that? Jesus. Do you believe that God? Don't listen. Wait. Do you believe that God? Yeah. Can hear without ears. God can hear without ears. Do you believe that? What's the point of that no, question? I'm asking a question. How do you know God doesn't have ears? No, I'm asking you a question. Okay, I'm telling you. No, you can't tell me. <laughs> well, when you ask a question, but I'm I telling you the answer. I, okay, go ahead. I'm telling you the answer. Okay. Okay. First and foremost, when you say, can God hear without ears? Yeah. You're assuming God doesn't have ears? No, I'm not. I don't know what part of his question then. Explain the question to me. You don't understand the question? No, I don't. Okay, what I'm saying is this. We have a God, the Bible says God is a spirit. Okay? Now, if God is a spirit, God can create something. Let me change the question. God can create something without nothing. Man cannot. No problem with Man, that. No, you don't have no problem I have no problem with that. Yeah. Okay, so do you believe that God can create a son without a woman. Create? You believe in, you, yeah, he created. You, so you believe in... The, okay, when the you say son. Birth. You believe... No, you, well, you believe in the... Hold on, virgin. when you say son, what you do you mean? You believe in the, the virgin birth. Yes, I do. Jesus Christ. Yes. Yeah. And you believe that Jesus Christ can be the son of God. He's not the son of God. Well, you well, don't believe he's the son. You. No, but... Can what do you mean by son? Okay. Okay, I have a son. Biological son. B a biological Thank son. Thank you very much. Okay. Now, you did you create you that by yourself? No, hold on, hold on. Okay. Would you believe then that yeah. God created all things? Yes, including Jesus Christ. Okay. Do you believe that God would call you his son? No. You don't believe that? Not the biological sense you think. No, I'm not talking about so the in what biological sense. sense. Exactly. No, no, you have no. to tell me what you no, mean no. by my son. I'm not talking about So tell me what son God. means. We don't talk about God in the biological sense. You so know. what sense you're talking you about? You do not say. I'm asking you now. In, in what sense when you say son, are you using the word son? Look, there are three ways. That's yeah. in the title. Okay, good. So in the title. Hold on. In how as I understand son, will you stop screaming? And there's no need for screaming. Okay. There are three ways I understand son. Yeah, go ahead. Okay? One is a biological son, which we already explained. Right. Yes. Second is a son might be an adopted son. Right. Yes. And the third is a metaphorical son. Right. Okay? Yes. Which is a figure of speech. Right. Okay? And when you talk about Jesus Christ as a son of God, yes. which three do you use from this? Which definition? We, we mean wait, wait, wait. Which definition? We, we mean that he, he was of the essence of God. Which of these three right? definitions? L let me explain. Christ was of the essence of God. That wasn't my question. Right? When I'm, you say I'm the Son to, of God... But, but let me finish. Okay, go on. We believe... This is, this is what I'm, I'm going to tell you. Yeah. I believe. Christ was of the essence of God. Just like when I look at you, you're the essence of, of a man. Yeah. Where you have two eyes, a nose, ears, a mouth. I can see that you are created as a man. I'm a human being, yeah. Right. Now, when when I see when I see when I say to you that God has a son called Jesus Christ, I also believe in what that sense? I am. Yeah. I also believe that I am the son of God. I don't believe that I'm the son of God because God had a wife and He made me. Yes, yes, no. Yes. So metaphorical. Metaphorical. Thank you. That's right. all I want to know. Right. Sorry to go so, around about. But, but you could have just said that metaphorical. Yeah. Because I gave you three options: but I, biological, adopted, metaphorical. All you have to say is metaphorical. But, but so when you say Jesus. Point. Christ is the son of God, all you're saying is a metaphorical son. Yeah. Like in the Bible, it says Adam is the son of God. In the genealogy of Jesus Christ, it says Adam is the son of God. Yes, that is also a metaphorical son. In fact, Adam would be more the biological, sorry, not the biological son, more literal son in the sense that he was directly created without a man or a woman. And so is Melchizedek. Do you know that? Yeah. Melchizedek. Ah, ah, yes. ah, if you want to get to Melchizedek, yeah. Melchizedek was the essence of Christ. It's Jesus. But was he Christ? Jesus Christ. Yes. yes. Really? Yes, he was. Why does he say yes, resembling he the son of man? Yes, he was. You know what resembling yes. means? Do, do you know, do, do you know what it says in Hebrews? Yes. He was in the order of Melchizedek. No, no, no. Hebrews, Before that, what does it say? It says that he, says, it says that he has listen, no... Listen, yeah, gone. he has no earthly father and he had no earthly mother. You added the word earthly? No, it said in the no, Bible. No, you added the word earthly, I'm sorry. No earthly mother. Don't put words in the Bible. I'm sorry. Father. You're twisting the Bible now. No, no. So are you are you're you twisting saying that, the scriptures? Are you saying that Melchizedek was what then? I'll, te I'll are tell you, you what. He was God? Hold on, I'll tell you what it says. Let Let's read the verse. Yeah, because it doesn't use the word earthly father or mother. Well, let's, let's see what it reads. Okay. Okay. He took to the, to the So anyway, so, so, at the, so at the end of the day, we would accept that 
the fact that you, if you believe in Jesus Christ... When you say Jesus Christ is a metaphorical son, that really is not a big problem to many people. Yeah. Yes? But the important thing is this. Do you actually say he's a but son of God, God or just a metaphorical? Son Jesus. Son called Jesus. Exactly. Because he would have to have a woman to create him. And I'm never saying that. Well, I'll tell you what Hebrews 7 says. Okay, about... How is it? Melchizedek? No, okay, it's before Hebrews 7, actually. Well, you before are, Hebrews the one 7. I'm... Melchizedek the one was, I'm telling you... Melchizedek. Yeah. Let me just explain to you. Melchizedek saw Abraham. Yes. Abraham and he, and he gave offerings to Abraham. Yes. Right. Was that Jesus, by the way? Yeah. He gave blessings of Abraham. Was that Jesus? Incarnated. Okay. Yes. So Jesus, incarnated. So Jesus did not come incarnated. Two thousand years ago, he came much before that. Of course, he existed. As a man, of course, he as existed. a man. Okay. He, so why does John say the beginning was the word? The word was God. Sorry, the he word existed. was. With, okay. Anyway, you're talking. Saint John Can I just 1, read the word, please? Saint, no, let me finish that quote. Oh, that man. You're Go on. Saint John one verse one. It says, "In the beginning was the word, and the word was with God. Was with him. I'm with you." Yeah. The word was with God, and the word was God. So when you're with someone, became, and it became flesh, yeah. and it dwelt among us. Yeah. That is Jesus. Jesus yeah. came. When you flesh, say, when you say with flesh, you don't let me have a word in between, but, man. But I'm trying to if you if you ask a question, allow me to answer. And it became. Flesh. When you ask a what question about Hebrews seven, I'm telling you what it says. But now wait, wait. Hebrews, why do you? Okay, I'll tell you what. You show me the other words. I'll show you this one. Right. Fair enough. Good. I'll tell you what Hebrews seven says. It does not say earthly father. It was because you twisted the no, scripture. No, I'm not twisting. You did. No, no, no. From, show me any words which says Abraham. earthly father. It's from okay. Abraham. Can you show me where it says earthly father yeah, and I'll show you why it doesn't say that? It doesn't. He doesn't have an earthly father. That's but you said he was saying. earthly father. Are you backtracking no. now? No, no you Come didn't on. Listen. You didn't Did he say earthly father, no, everyone? I did not. Did he say that? I did you're on, You're on camera, man. I, I did not say it. Earthly father and mother. I didn't say it. He has no earthly father. Yeah, but he, he had no earthly okay. mother. So why did you... I'm talking about Melchizedek. Oh, he did not have. No, he okay. did not have. But you added the word earthly in there. But it's the same That's thing. what you're saying it's that added. Exactly okay, so we can say the listen, same. Listen, listen, let, let me tell you this. Yeah. Some people say the sun is rising. I can say, oh no, the earth is revolving around the sun. The earth is going down. Listen, we talk in the expression that we can simply understand. Yeah. Okay, you're here it is. With words. Here it is. Look, say it is says rising. here. No scientist is going to come up to me and say, I know, I know, get the, the point. Sun is can we, rising. Is the earth can going around the sun? Can we, we, can we read without the sarcasm now? Please. Well, but you it says here, without father, without father or mother, without genealogy. Yes? Without the beginning of days or oh, end of life. Oh, Can I finish? No, let's stop. No, because stop interrupting. I'm sorry. Earthly. Stop interrupting. The sun doesn't revolve around said, you. He was criticizing. He said okay. earthly. Now, where is the criticism? Can I? He's agreeing with Can I finish? I didn't finish yet. Yeah. It says here, resembling the son of God. So when you resemble your son, does that mean your son is you? Naturally not. Exactly my point. So it says here, go, oh, wait a minute. You said Melchizedek was Jesus. Did you say that or not? Yes, yes. It says you're resembling the Re Son of God. What does it mean? Re Re resembling the Son of God. Re what does it mean resembling the Son of God? Do you know what does it mean God, mean? Son of God? Do you know no, it does not. Just like your do Son, you, do you know when He resembles you... Mean? Yes, I know. Oh, By the way, it was... Incarnated, not reincarnated. What? Incarnated. <laughs> it's a big difference. So I'm correcting okay. you based on. So when okay. he says, so hold on, hold on, hold on, so you, hold on. When you say resembling, words. hold on. So, when you so, say resembling the so son you're of God. Just words. No, I'm not. I say I'm my correcting son you. Me, look like me, or I say my son is me. Exactly. Big difference. No, listen. Big difference. Listen. listen, listen. Big difference. But I'm not. Do you not see it? When you say your listen, son looks listen, like you, and I'm when saying, you say my son is me, I'm there's saying, a big difference. I'm saying Thank you, I rest my case. I'm, I'm saying Jesus I'm sorry you Christ. lost it in that one. I'm saying Jesus Christ is Melchizedek is not, it says it without mother and father. Did Jesus have a mother? And listen, 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 no, Did no, Jesus no. have a mother? I'm down, yeah. you, you, See, that you is two points he got him on. No, no, two listen. points. You God believe that Jesus Did Jesus have a genealogy? Was by Mary. Was that? Jesus, Jesus was, was created. Jesus was ex Mary gave Mary. birth to him. Exactly. Jesus existed he before existed. Mary. That wasn't and the question. Is Mary's and mother? That's why I'm saying he was Mary. Was Mary his mother? And that's why I'm saying he was. I was. I know. And that's why. Hello, listen, listen. They tried to stop. Are you talking to each other? Okay, let me know in your answer. Yeah. Yeah. They tried to stone him. Yeah. I know. Is Mary the but as long as you believe I can't get a word in between. What is the Let me know when you finish. Uh, as long as you believe in Jesus Christ and you believe in God, we do not have an argument. No, we do. Because you believe Jesus is God. 
Okay. No, I don't. Oh, sorry, you sorry. So he's not a Christian then? No, no. Okay. You, listen, now you tell listen, me. Listen, listen. God, <laughs> God <laughs> has a father. God is the father of Jesus. <laughs> right? In what sense? Jesus. We're not going to go back into metaphoric, metaphoric. sense. But see, it. No, no, I need to I know. Need to because say. he is now looking at no, you with no, a big listen, question mark. Listen, <laughs> listen, listen. I believe listen, it. I listen. Okay, fair when, enough. When in in St. John 17. In St. John 17. In St. John 17, Jesus was praying to his father. He, the he said, my father is greater than I. Exactly. Okay? So, that's what he says. My father is greater than I. What do you mean Jesus existed before Mary then? If you don't believe he's God? Because what do you mean by that? Because Jesus was always with his father. Since when? Since when? He, he was, since when? Since when? In eternity has no time. Okay, so you're saying, you're saying Jesus existed with the father, yet he's not God. In eternity. Yes, I know. Yeah. Yet he's not God. Angels are with God now. Not, no, angels were created. I, I, and I then they began. Of course, of course. But not since the but beginning. Angels, angels are with God right now. Yes. Right? yes. And they are not, no, no, hold on. But they are not human. They are not human. What's that right? point got to do with anything? Because now we're going when to. When you say someone exists going, since eternity. Now we're going to a can celestial it, view. Okay, can I ask now you something? To a can anyone. With God. Oh, I can't right? get a, You know, can we have a dialogue, Jesus please? Jesus Christ was with My friend, God what's your name? What's your name? John, can we have a dialogue? No, 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 Jesus, okay, yes, can God. anyone other than God exist since eternity? Yes, Jesus and the Holy Spirit. So Jesus is God. So you do believe in the, the Trinity? Yeah, yes, yes, I do. And you, Father, and you say Jesus is not God? Holy Ghost. And you say Jesus is not God? Jesus, Father, 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 are, you, are you saying Jesus is not God? The word. I'm saying Jesus Wait, wait, wait. The word. You just backtracked. Earlier you said he wasn't God. Now you're saying he is? Jesus is the word. No. Yes. No. Uh -huh. Yes. Jesus, Jesus. You believe in the Trinity, yet you don't believe in his God. In Deuteronomy 6, verse 4, it says, Here is what the Lord our God our is one. God is one Absolutely. God. Okay, so there is only one God. And who's the Trinity? And, and I'm saying he has a son. God, his son is part of the Trinity. And Why did he say that in the Bible? The and you've got the Show me the Trinity in the Bible. And you, listen, for, Trinity is not in the Bible. Not the word, the concept. Trinity. Show me a three in one concept. Trinity is not in the Bible. Three in one concept. The Bible doesn't say we must smoke. Ma I didn't ask you for the word. But, concept of Trinity. But, but, but listen, okay. You know, if you listen, in, you'll get a dialogue. In Genesis, you're listening. In Genesis 1. One at a time. In Genesis Genesis 1, yeah. right? this is where we understand Okay, that Genesis God, 1 says what? Let, let me finish. Go on. In Genesis 1, this is where we understand that God was not alone when he created this earth. Where does okay? it say it's it says, three in, in one? Let me finish. Yeah. Right? In Genesis 1, this is where we understand that God was not alone when he created the earth. He says, let us create man. In, and, and, and in Genesis 1, verse 26, he says, let us create man. And he created man. If you read 26 of Genesis 1, that's when he created man. Now if God was just on his own and he wasn't speaking to the Who angels, said he was on his own? And he wasn't speaking to the When he created man, who said he was on his own? No, there I'm were angels around him? No, no. Like you said, let, like, like you said, let me finish. One, one yes, let me finish. So, so that's where... Were there angels with him then? And that is where... Hold on. Were, we're, we're there angels? angels. We're but I'm talking about angels. You said he wasn't alone. I agree he wasn't alone. Okay. But he had angels with him. Okay. So okay. when he says, let us create man in our image, Yes? Yeah. Yes? Yes. What does it mean that there was more than one God? What does the word us mean? No. No. What does no, it mean, us? No. In the Hebrew language, there was only in that one context, God. There was exactly. Only one God. So why do you say three? No, I say Trinity doesn't mean. Look, Trinity means in essence. For instance, you are, you are, you are, you are. Listen, I'm sorry. In, 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 this, Trinity, in, this, in, this, in this, in this, in yeah, this, that on. you are body, soul, and spirit. Yeah. Your soul, your soul, right? Is is your want. You know, your, your soul is your want. Your flesh will not live forever. But your flesh will not. Live forever. We believe that when, so when, 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 when God comes so back, right, your mind, your body we know the Messiah is coming back. Show me the three in one in the Bible, please. Right? When, when the, you know, I can, I can hear to your guys, guys, one discussion at a time. Listen, if you can both show me anywhere in the Bible the three in one concept, not the word Trinity, then I can say, yes, you have some point. I don't want you to. Okay, read it to me. Read it to me. Go ye therefore and baptize in the name of the Father, Son, and of the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Okay, so what do we get from that? Who is that name? Hold on. Can I answer? You, can I respond? Oh, you will told you. Can I respond what to name? that? Fine. What name? Without you interrupting, can I respond? What name comes all three times? Can I respond without interrupting? Go on. What is my question? To show me where I'm saying, show me where it says Matthew that the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Read it. You've got it on your face. I know what it Matthew says. 28. I know what it says. Show me where it says the Father. Hold on. Show me where it says the Father, the Son. 
My, I'm Twitter. telling you what my question was. Yeah. Show me where he says the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit are one. Not that they had one the name. name. Yeah. The name. I didn't ask if they had one name. Okay. 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 Show me these three are one. What, you want me to show you? Yes, please. Jesus said it in St. John. Show me he what says, he says. Three. He says. He says Make sure the three are one. He says, me and my Father I only, are one. That's only two? Hold on. Hold on. He says, me and my Father yeah. are one. That's only two? Listen. Show he me says, the three are one. Listen, he says, me and my father are one. For instance, if I, if, you, if I give you the concept that Jesus Christ, as we said in Matthew 28, says, go and baptize in the name of the Father, the name. Son, and Holy Ghost. That is the concept. If That's you don't want to explain... It doesn't say they're one. one no, I'm sorry, it doesn't Jehovah. say they're one. Listen, one name. Look, the word Jehovah is not in the name. New Testament, I'm Listen, sorry. Listen, Listen. The Father, and Son, and Holy Ghost. For one you, name, three, show three. me why it says the three are one. You. Not that one name. You know, yeah. I didn't ask you for one name. You, you don't even know what that one name is. Jehovah. What is the one name? Jehovah. Do you know the one name that Jesus told in 28:19? Jehovah. In Matthew 28:19, what is that one name? Wait. Wait a minute. What is the one name? You, you can you can say it's Jehovah. You know it is Jehovah. So you're saying the name of Jesus is Jehovah? No. God exactly. Has God. God has many names. <laughs> so what he says in the name of the Father? Wait. We understand the name of Father is Jehovah. Okay. We got. We are fine with that. But next is the name of the Holy Spirit Jehovah. Because there's no one name. The, the Holy Spirit. You know the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit. You're trying to. The Holy Spirit, not the Father. You create the Holy Spirit is not the you, Father. No, the Holy Spirit is a different person. It's exactly. The same God, it's the same God. So what is the name of the Holy Spirit? It's the same. It's the Holy Spirit. That's not a name. It's a spirit. What is the name? You want no. to give name Look, to a spirit? The name of Jesus is Jesus. Name to a spirit. The name of the you Father is. Name to air. Go. Oh, so Holy Spirit is there. Right. That's it. Go. No, be no. I'm just saying. I'm you, disciple, you know the reason you guys don't have the Trinity in the name. Exactly. Of the I didn't ask you which name. Did I ask you which name? He, he's not accepted. My question is: he's not Show me that. these three persons are one. Jehovah. Yes. He's not Where's the Jehovah in the New Testament? Show me. What's God's name? Show me New Testament Jehovah. Yahweh. Yahweh. Yahweh is not in the New Testament. Yahweh. Yahweh. God in I the am. New Testament. I am. I am is Ehyeh. I am. Ehyeh. I am. Eh I am. Before Abraham was, I am. Exactly. That's not Jehovah. So Yahweh covers all three titles. Yahweh. It's not mean I am. Guys need to I learn am. the basics of Hebrew. I am. I am. Look, you're you're pointing to ex Exodus 5:13, 5:15. Am I right? Yeah. Show me the word. Wait, wait, wait. My name is I am. No, no. You know what it says in that? Wait. I am. Hold on. Do you know what it says there in Hebrew? It says Ahye, Asher, Ahye. Not Yahweh. So you guys are absolutely wrong. It is Yahweh. You know it's not. Show me Hebrew. Hebrew. Exactly. I, I quoted to you in Hebrew. So, so, so and I quoted to you in Hebrew. Are you saying, are you saying, are you saying Show me God? the name, the are three saying, the three persons in one name. We've shown you and you no, don't want to take You yeah. said, look, right. you said the name of the Father is Yahweh. Okay, okay. fine. The name of Jesus is Jesus. What is the name of the Holy Spirit? All three have different names. <laughs> one name carries Look, you went away when I discussed the Trinity. Show me the three in one. Jehovah. Jehovah. Jehovah's only the New Testament. The argument is going to matter. But the thing it's is, it's you believe in Jesus. It's no, no, the Bible. Let me yeah. just say, well, you've been talking all this time. Let me just say, no, let me just say, right? Things from the Bible. What is not the Bible? Listen, with God, with God, in the, in the Bible, in, in, yeah. with God in the Bible, with God in the Bible, when God is being a provider, they would say it's Jehovah, Jireh. Why don't you have Jehovah in the New Testament? Why? It's in the Old Testament. In the Old Testament, six thousand times. In the New Testament, zero times. Why? Why you've checked away the name of God? By the way, what is the name of your God? One Bible. What's the name of your God? Jehovah. Is it in the New Testament? It's in the Old Testament. But is it in the New Testament? It's not in the Bible. So you're saying, Bible so you're saying Bible. Jesus did not All even scripture. bless you with his name of the name of God. God. You know what? My God gave me 99 names. Your God gave you zero names. Why is that? Jehovah is his name. Not in the Jehovah. New Testament. Old Testament. The Old Testament for the Jews. Bible. For the Jews or for you? The Old Testament for you. Is it for you? Seriously. So you basically, circ do you circumcise? Huh? No. Why? No. I thought you said because it's for you. The New Covenant. Ah, so it's not for you then. The new covenant. You see, that's the a double covenant. standard. They get caught out. Jehovah's name. They get caught out by that. Do you do you keep the Sabbath? It's not different God. Do you keep the Sabbath? It's not different God. Do you keep the Sabbath? No. It's exactly. Not God. So Old Testament not for you. It's one God. It's one God. Of course, there's one God. So one don't God say three. Throughout the Bible. So don't say three. Exactly my point. And New Testament. Thank you. That one God. Why do you say three then? So who is the name of the Father? So Why do you say three in one then? Jehovah. Show me the three in one in the Bible. Trinity. Your Trinity. Where is the three in one? You don't have it. Admit it. Come on. Admit it. It's in the Bible. Are you going to run away as well like the other guy? When I brought up the Trinity, he ran away. He was very confident of himself. When, he, when I said this one name, yes, which you're talking about, you don't even know that one name. Jehovah. Is that God. the Father? God. It's God. Okay. Jehovah's God. Is the name of Jesus Jehovah? God. He's talking about God. In That's right. Is the name of so Jesus? talking about? Can I ask you a question? What? Is the name of a Jesus? A dog? No. Why are you thinking about cats and dogs now? Because you're not getting my points. Are you all up? You're not getting my points. Are you all up there or not? God is referred to. What is the name of Jesus? The name of God. Is it Yahweh? Yahweh, Jehovah, Jesus. So the name of Jesus is. As, as so you're saying name. Jehovah and Allah Jesus are the same? Allah has 99 names. Yes. yes. <laughs>
Are you jealous? Okay, what's your point? You didn't get any. What's your point? <laughs> So if you'd say that, the point is this, my God, God bless me with 99 point? names. Well, Why did your God not give you even one? Jehovah. Not even one. So, and it's not in the New Testament. So your God can have a million names. It doesn't mean your God is the truth. No, now, no, 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 no. It shows, look, when Jehovah. Jesus says, go and baptize them in the name of God, and you don't even what know the name of God. What did, you, what did you do in Acts? They baptized in the name did of Did anyone Jesus. baptize him in that name? They baptized in Jesus' name. Did anyone baptize him? Jesus' name covers all the ah, So you're telling, you know how many baptisms, wait, do you know how many baptisms that they're in Acts? How many? Quite a few, quite a few, exactly. Was, did anyone in the entire Bible baptize anyone else in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit? No, because you know why? Why? Because Jesus is the name. Jesus is the name, and he comes all three times. So, from so basically, point. you're saying Jesus, they all Jesus rejected. All three. They all rejected the, the injunction of Jesus. Jesus. Jesus commands them to go and baptize them in Jesus the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. He says, and none of them does it. In the name. None of them does in it. The name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost. What what name covers? Yeah, exactly. What name? Jesus name. So you're saying now not Yahweh. You're, you're going Jesus to Jesus name. now. That's you see what you've done now? Jesus Have you seen? Name. Until now you were going on Yahweh, 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 it's Yahweh. Person, when I questioned Jesus, the baptism, Yahweh, Jehovah, he went to where? It's Jesus. God. One God. They can't make up the mind. God has 99 names, so why can't, why can't I can't have three? You don't have even one. Forget about nine, three. Yourself. Are you jealous you don't have even one? This is matter. You By the way, your God can have a million. Is, is, God are you saying the Father is the same as Jesus? We talked about it's the Trinity. The three are one, Jehovah. Okay, so who died on the cross? The, the Word, the Son, the Son. But I thought you, they were all the same. The flesh. Word, I, I thought you said they're the all the same. became flesh. So they're not the same. Then. But the Father was still in heaven. Thank you, so they're not the same. And the Father is the Holy Spirit. So one is up there, one is so on the God cross, dead. Omnipresent. That's fine, that's fine. They, no, no, it's not omnipresent. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Omnipresent. Are they mortal? The God, the flesh is, um, isn't immortal. Oh, I see. Is the flesh part of God? The flesh, it, the God came down in flesh. Yeah. Is the flesh part of God? Is the flesh part of the Trinity? The, fle he, the flesh, he came down in flesh. Is the flesh part of the Trinity? No, it's not. No. Thank you very much. No. So basically from the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit, it is the flesh which died, which is not even part of the Trinity. So none of them died. But God took on human form. None of them died. You died. Did you realize died. what you just done? The body. That's Have died. you realized the what you just done? Peace, the fourth part, which is not even part of the Trinity, God died. Existed. That wasn't my question. Well, that, you're that, telling that, me the fourth part, which is not part of the Trinity, died. But they won. So you're saying... But they but the one. What? You just said he's not part of the Trinity. So if one part of God dies, he's still No, alive. no, no, no. The flesh is not part of God. You already said it. Yeah, but he left, it. he came down, the flesh, the word became flesh. So Regardless, is the flesh part of the Trinity? The word became flesh. Is the flesh part of the Trinity? Not a Trinity, no. Not a Trinity, no. Any time? I think it's time. Okay. Was it part of the Trinity? What do you mean part of the Trinity? You understood my question. God Come on. the Trinity. I didn't ask you that. Is the flesh part the of the Trinity? Trinity? God is the Trinity. Okay, do you know what the Trinity is? Yes. Good. Three and one. Do you know what a flesh is? Your Trinity. Hold on. Do you know what a flesh is? Do you know what flesh is? Yeah, I know what flesh is. Okay, you understand what is Trinity, you understand what is flesh. Is the flesh part of this Trinity which you understand? The flesh is a part of the Trinity. That's a, that's a good sign, you're thinking finally. You're finally thinking. Because you were all blah 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 blah. <laughs> Without thinking, you were talking. It's a mystery. Ah, the M word. I was just waiting for that. When was the M word going to come? Do you know who Allah is? Do you know who Allah is? I know who Allah is. Yes, I do. Because Allah says so. Allah says in the Quran, He's unlike anything else. Where is He? Oh, now another question. We're asking about Allah all of a sudden. You just, you just found Allah? What? Because you lost the Trinity and you found Allah now. Look, the flesh is a part of the Trinity for the fourth time. So the word took on human form. Flesh. flesh. And the flesh. Down. The flesh is a part of the Trinity. Is the flesh God? No, because the question is too shallow. You see what I mean? It doesn't make you sense. know earlier, earlier you actually answered that question. Yeah. But the second time, when I actually showed him that fully, then he basically backtracked now. <laughs> It's, it's, it's not a yes or no answer. It is. You already answered earlier. You your time. No answer. Earlier, you already said no. According to your my question. friend, uh, my question was same. Is the flesh part of the Trinity? Same question. And now you backtracked on the answer. According to your question. Okay. So, so I'm making it. So okay. If I say no, I'm wrong. If I say yes, I'm wrong. So I don't have an answer. So basically, you got a cash 22. Do you realize that? Do you realize? You got a cash 22. Yeah. By the way, is God the author of confusion? No, he's not. So what you're reading is not the Bible then? From God? It's not confusion. Because you're confused. You said mystery. Yeah, but you don't know who God is. You don't even know if there are three or the flesh is God you, or not. You don't know who Allah is. I know who Allah is. No, yes, I do. No, Maybe I don't understand everything about Allah. Why are you talking about? Have you seen? But I, hold on. What's your problem I, then? I'll tell you what. 
I know Allah oh. based on what He revealed you, to me. You contradict yourself just there. No, I didn't. I know what Allah. I know what Allah revealed to me. Okay, for example, is God? Our mind. Okay, hold on. Come, come, come. Does, God. does God? Does God know everything? So what is saying, saying to me? Detail. I don't know the answer. Does God know everything? No. Do you know the answer? Does He know God everything? Is a mystery. Good. And does, you don't know did God. God tell you that He knows everything? Know no. Do you at least know the bits about God that He told you. Uh, you know the attributes, right? You, okay, good. Go. So one of his attributes is omniscience. Do you agree? Yeah. What does omniscience mean? He's omnipresent. No, that's a different word. Do you know what omniscience means? It means all-knowing. Okay. Okay. So God is omnipresent and omniscient. Okay. Omniscient means all-knowing. Do you believe God is all-knowing? Is the Holy Spirit all-knowing? Yeah. Why did Jesus say that only the Father knows the hour? That was his flesh speaking. Regardless, he had human form and, and, okay. and spirit. Did he know what he was talking about? The flesh doesn't know. Does Jesus know God? The flesh Fair, know. The flesh okay. Know. Does Jesus know God better than you and me? He had human form and spirit. I'm not talking about Jesus. Does Jesus know? So the flesh I'm talking about the knowledge of Jesus. Does Jesus know God better than you and me? Of course, yeah. Good. Does Jesus know the Holy Spirit better better than you and me? Of course, yeah. Good. Did Jesus say only the Father knows the hour? Yeah. Does that include the Holy Spirit? God's the Spirit. That wasn't the question. When Jesus says only the God's Father the knows, hold on. When Jesus says only the Father knows, God's the Holy Spirit. By the way, he didn't say only the Spirit knows. He God's says, God, Jesus said that God is the Spirit. What did Jesus say in so Mark 13 32? When he said only the Father knows the other. Exactly. About the the okay. Father and the Spirit. So when he says only the Father knows, did he mean only the Father and Spirit? It's the same. No, it's not. It's, it's, so why did he say only the Father? That's the way you get, you get okay. confused. Because you think the Father and the Spirit are if, all. If you're saying, people. wait, wait, if you're saying. the same essence. So was Jesus telling you? Lie then? It's the same. Was Jesus telling a lie? Jehovah is the spirit. Okay. And, and is the son? Is the, 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 the son same as so the father is in heaven? The son is on earth, dying on the cross, and and the spirit, God's the spirit. Okay. And they all are God, right? The three are one. They, they all are one God. The three are one. Okay. So why is two thirds of the Trinity ignorant of the hour? It's the son doesn't know. The Holy Spirit the doesn't know. know. Only the Father knows. The human didn't know. No. So are you saying? So wait, wait. Are you saying? Wait, are you saying Jesus? He left, when he was on earth, he, he was left, only a flesh. He left his full knowledge in heaven. So is he fully God? That, so he's limited in knowledge. He's limited in power. Oh, where is his limit? So, but he was still wait, God in heaven. Why do you call him fully God then? If he's limited. He's, he's God in heaven. No, but why do you call him fully God? He's God in heaven. Is he fully God? That's the Trinity. Is he fully God? Is Jesus fully God? The Trinity form, yes. No, no, I'm asking Jesus. Do you know why? Because when Jesus rose from the dead, he says, all power has been returned. He said, all power on heaven and earth has been returned unto me. Yeah. Given to me. Give has been given to me. Yes. He gave it back. He left it there and he gave it back into okay. his Okay. Good, good, good. Very good. Stay there. So you're saying Jesus was given all authority and power on earth. Yes? Okay. Yet in John 5.30, what does he say? What's he I can of myself do nothing. Exactly. <laughs> That was flesh speaking. How is that even? God was Can you realize this? Look, look, listen. You said Jesus was given all God authority was, and power. God was and in Christ. Yet, of course he was. I don't so why was he helpless if he was in Christ? God was in Christ. Exactly. Why he was, was he helpless? But God's omnipresent as well. No, no, that wasn't the question. The why question. does Jesus say he's helpless? But that's the answer. No, that's the, that's, that's, that's the, the answer. point you're not answering. No, why did Jesus say he's helpless? I answered the question. Is Jesus helpless? The flesh was helpless, yes. Okay. When he was in flesh, hold on. When you, when, you say, when you say he's in flesh, it's as simple as that. Was Jesus zero percent? in God or 100 percent God he's full God in three three is what? Jesus zero percent God 100 percent God during his ministry the limb when he was when he's in his flesh he yeah know was he God at all he was God in, yeah God in Christ yeah. okay so he was fully God he was God God was in him was he fully God God was in him was Jesus fully God he wasn't fully at, in the flesh no he but, wasn't fully God so the scripture says he left his glory thank you very much. and he limited himself so basically you're he saying no, no, that's himself. good that's good this is why so that's good, good. Know okay so you're saying but the father himself his glory knew the hour okay so father knew what part that don't you understand what about the holy spirit why you the, why, why the what about the holy spirit I, I told you the answer the bible says only the father the bible says god god was in christ reconciling the whole world unto himself okay what did jesus say about the final hour the last hour when he was asked this question did did he say only God knows or did he say only the Father knows? Who is the Father? The Father is God, yeah? Yes, only one God. The point, the point is What's this, the point? Is, the, is God only the Father? What? <laughs> look, look, the penny dropped. Because your question doesn't make any sense. It does, it does. It does. 
What? Is God only the Father? What do you mean He's God only the Father? Okay, you believe in the Trinity? God is just God, without oh. including Jesus and the Holy Spirit. Yeah. God, he's, he's three in one. Thank you! So this three in one, two third are There's ignorant, why? Because the body has limited knowledge. The yeah, Holy Spirit doesn't have body. But the full knowledge wasn't. Holy Spirit doesn't have body. No, it's not the same. It is. So what you're saying, look, your excuse for Jesus. God. Well, I'm not. You're so actually God dividing it. Third. I'm saying they're one. You're no, dividing no, them into you three. <laughs> you're the one dividing them into three. That's why you're in this confusion now. That's the reason. You know? In order to in, o in order to in order to build up one lie, you have to invent another one. I'm not. The yes. mind has limited knowledge. Exactly. So your mind tells you that the point is this: is Holy Spirit if God's all knowing? It was in me. It, 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 it would destroy me. Excuse me. It's mystery. It's mystery. Mystery. It would, it would destroy me. God's full knowledge would 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 it destroy the Holy Spirit? It would kill me. Would it destroy the Holy Spirit? God's full knowledge would kill me because so much information. Yeah, you're not God. We know that already. Leave it up there. No. Yeah, yeah. Look, look. Thank God you're not God. <laughs> Trust me. Thank God. You're not God. Now the question is this: Is God is, is God only the Father? There we are. Is your answer? No, that's not the answer. But is answer. God only the Father? What do you mean, is God only the Father? Which part of that you don't understand? I don't understand the question. The question is this: Do you do you know what God is? No, I don't. You don't. No, no, do you? So you're saying no that. So is. you're saying the Trinity is not no, God. You don't know who. So why do you saying the Trinity is God then, if you don't know who God is? Yeah, the Trinity is God. The Bible helps explain who. He the Bible doesn't say the Trinity. We don't know the full depth of who God is. No, no, no. do you? The Bible says very clearly God is all knowing. Do you agree? He's all knowing. Okay. Yes. Is the Holy Spirit is the Holy Spirit all knowing, all knowing? I don't know all of him. I don't care about you. Is the Holy Spirit all knowing? But that's, but that's the question. No, I didn't ask about you. When did you ask about you? Me, you asked me uh, every detail about Jehovah. I don't know. <coughs> ask him yourself. I don't know every single. Was Jesus telling a lie when he said only the Father knew the hour? Was he telling a lie? He wasn't lying. Okay, should I believe the Bible or should I believe you? He wasn't lying. Should I believe the Bible or you? Believe the Bible. Okay, the Bible says only the Father. Exactly. So that excludes so who's the Father? that excludes whom? The name of the Father. Hold on. And of the Son. Don't go to the name. The Holy Ghost. When he says what only, you know the what he's doing? And the Son. Because the he knows Jesus he's changing the topic. So therefore, that's the Trinity. Don't worry, I'll heaven, come back to that. Earth, I'm very good at holding so you on the topic. But the Son didn't have, didn't, didn't know the Lord. Was Jesus telling a lie? Only the Father knew. What do you understand? Was he telling the lie? No. Exactly. So why are you saying the Holy Spirit knows the hour? The Trinity. The name of the Father. So is Jesus the in the Trinity. The but Jesus doesn't know the hour. The Holy Spirit doesn't know the hour. Only the Father. Yes. yes. Exactly. So two thirds is ignorant. God is you can put it that way, but that, that that's not me putting that it. That's what Jesus is saying. But that doesn't the Trinity. That's what it does. It does. Because look, no, it do you agree God is all knowing? Do you agree God is all knowing? Do you not believe God is all knowing? Yeah, go on. So do you want to know? Do you know what the question is before you explain to me? I know the thing. I know the Trinity. What is the question? No, no, it's not the Trinity. The question, the question you asked Wait, wait, let, let him say. The last question you asked <coughs> What? If Jesus knows the hour. No. My, question. my question is, does the Holy Spirit know the hour? He knows. God is he knows? Yeah. So Jesus was telling a lie when he says only the Father knows. Wait a minute, you had a chance. Let him answer. Are you saying Jesus was telling lies when he says only the Father knows? Mark 13, 32. No, sorry? Mark 13, 32 says no one knows the hour. Okay, good. No one knows the hour, not the angels in heaven, not the Son, except the Father in heaven. Okay? When he says except the Father, he did not say except the Father and the Holy Spirit. Before that, he actually negates everyone else. He said, do you mind? Do you mind? Okay, so now the question to you is, does the Holy Spirit know the hour? And if you say yes, I need supporting... What, what did I say before? You haven't said yes? No. I said yes, right? You said yes? I said yes. Y yes what? I, I said the Holy Spirit knows the hour. Okay, where's the evidence for that? God okay. No, no, I'll, I'll show you. Go on. If you read the Bible, did you read the whole Bible? Not the whole Bible, I read okay. parts if of it. If you read the Bible, yeah? yeah? The Holy Spirit is in the Old Testament, right? You give me the answer, I'll listen. Okay? okay. Go on. The, the, the and will you not interrupt, please? Let him finish the answer. The Holy Ghost is <coughs> explained in the Old Testament. <coughs> and the Holy Ghost is all known already in the Old Testament. Show me the evidence for that. I can show you. Show me. Okay, I'll show you. I'll let me explain first. Okay? No, no, par paraphrase. I don't need the exact same words. I just paraphrase what it says. That's all. I just explain. Okay? Go on. Okay. So, the Holy Spirit is all known in the Old Testament. Yeah, I heard that. Okay. But I need you let to explain. Please don't talk. But evidence. Oh, go ahead. Wait, 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 evidence. Wait, yeah, go on. Okay. If the Bible talks about God, the Old Testament, it's only God. 
No, no, no. It's only God or Yahweh. Only the name. Brother, I can't hear. One, yeah, one, one second. Yeah. Come this yeah, way. Yeah, go on. Always God or the name, Yahweh. Okay? In the Old Testament, because Jesus came, it's either God or the Father. Or Yahweh. That was God. Okay? And if you read, the Father is still God. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah, carry on. I'm listening. If you read, the Father is always God. Okay? Is the Father... The, the Father is God. Is the Father the Holy Spirit? It's the next question. Please let me ask. Good. Okay, go on. So, if you read, the Father is God. Okay. okay. That's fine. Jesus came carry on. as flesh. Okay? Yeah. He was, okay. So he was human. Human. Uh, yes, human nature and divine nature. Okay? And he explained everyone. He said that he's God. He said it. I didn't ask you about Jesus. The question is I'm about the Holy finished. Spirit. I'm not finished. But why are you ask, answering a question which I didn't ask you? I'm, I'm if you if you I'm just answering. answer I'm my answering. question, that's I'm all. I'm but answering. not about the Holy Spirit. You're going on about Jesus. I'm, I'm answering. Yeah, but you're answering a question I didn't ask you. It's like me asking you where do you live? You say my name is John. You see what I mean? No, no, no. Answer the specific question. When you say the Holy Spirit knows the hour, I need you to back it up with evidence. You don't have the understanding. Okay, you don't have the understanding, so I have to explain it. So you're saying, do you want, okay, do you want to know the answer? I want to know the answer to, answer to the specific question. That's all. Do you want to know? Or not? To the specific question. Can you answer to the specific question? Good. Answer them. Am I finished? Yes. Am I finished? You haven't finished. That's what I'm telling you. Okay, if you listen. Yeah, go on. Okay. Jesus had human nature and divine nature. Okay. In this um, verse, you said, okay. Only God knows. Him. Only the Father knows, not only, God. Only the, only exactly, the yes. Okay? And I said already, if you read the Father, it's always God. And you, we, we know that the Holy, Holy Ghost, the Holy Spirit, is God. So the God is, uh, the Holy Spirit is included in the Father. So, so why did Jesus not say, no one knows the hour, not the angels in heaven, not the Son? Because you Hold, let me finish. Except the Father and the Spirit. Why did he say only the Father? Are you saying, wait, are you saying the Holy Father, uh, uh, the Holy Spirit is the Holy Father? Is that what you're saying? It's just whatever people are. Are you saying the Holy Spirit is the Holy Father? Is the Holy Spirit the Father, yes or no? The Holy Spirit is not the Father. Thank you. So when Jesus says, only the Father knows, does that include the Holy Spirit or excludes him? If you read Father in the New Testament, it can be God. I'm talking, about, be, I'm talking about Mark 13, 32. Stick to that verse. Was Jesus telling a lie when he says only the Father knows? Because when I say, look, when I say only you are wearing a white shirt here, yes? Does that mean everybody else is wearing white shirt? The word only means exclusivity. What you, what, what you, what you, right now, what you're saying doesn't make sense. What? If you know English, it will make sense. When I say, when I say only you... No, no, nothing to do with it. Oh my God. It does! With the Jews understanding. So if, you re, if you're speaking to the Jews... Do you know Hebrew? I know Hebrew. Do you know Hebrew? If you speak, wait, wait, wait. Oh my God. When you say you know Hebrew, speak. what is the word? What is the word Let for only speak. in Hebrew? Let me speak. What is the word for only Let in Hebrew? Speak. Let me speak. You're asking ten questions. I didn't. No, I said the same question, bro. No. Yes. You're asking me, bro. You're making you Jesus look like a liar now. You know that. Let me answer. Let me answer. Go on, please. Okay, thanks. I said to you, if you're speaking to Jews, if you're speaking to Jews, okay, and you saying the Father, they know you're speaking about God. Yes. No problem with that. Saying. Good. Okay. If Jesus is saying only the Father knows, okay, he said, so he's saying that Jesus no man knows, so he's saying he's um, above man. No, um, neither the angels, so he's saying he's above the angels. Not even the Son. Exactly. Okay, not even the Son. That destroys sun. your point, isn't it? Because you're trying to say Father is God. You see, you don't realize it. You don't realize, do you? You don't, you don't want to let me speak, that's why. No, no, no be be because I you're trying finish. to... I wasn't finished. Okay, go on, sorry. I, I should let you finish, go on. Okay. What he's trying to say is, because you know, he also prayed to the Father. Okay. Yes, and he worshipped him as well, on his forehead, yeah. on his face, on the ground, she want, she like the Muslims do. So how did they, how did they know the Father? He wants us um, to know that the Father, that the Father sent him. He's not obeying the Father. He's not obeying. He is obeying the Father. He's obeying. Yeah, this is what I'm saying. Oh, okay. What I'm saying. He's obeying. He's obeying. Okay, go on. Go on. Yeah. He's, he worshipped him. Okay. He's like. Uh, What's that got like to do with the Spirit? He's like. You keep, you're going into Jesus again. No. I, I Stick to the Spirit. I already the said question you, is about the, the Holy Spirit. Is in the Father. No, 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 no. Hold on. When you, what do you mean the Holy Spirit is in the Father? If you read. Where do you get that from? 
The spirit is in the father, seriously? Look, look, look. So you're saying the spirit is the father? What I'm saying is if you read father yes. in the new Father Testament. means God. I got that point. Good. Finish. Finish. Now when you say father, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Did you not say that the father is not the Holy Spirit earlier? Yeah. Good. So now when you say the father is not the Holy Spirit and Jesus says only the father knows, you have excluded the Holy Spirit. Yes. Look, unless, let me, let me give look, you look, if Jesus me, said let me only God answer. knows, then I understand. Let me give but you Jesus answer, okay? specifically says only the Father knows. Let me give you an answer, okay? Um, if you read um, Romans, okay? Romans. It's a book in the book. I know Romans is a book. Okay. What's the point? Like you don't know. Okay. If you read Romans, okay? There's a verse. I'm looking at you changing topics here. Okay. No, I'm explaining to you the Bible because you don't, about the Holy you Spirit, don't know. Spirit, my friend. You don't know. You already, you already said the Holy Spirit is not the Father. You have already, you have already clearly stated that. Brother, brother. When Jesus says brother, only the Father, I will, I will, I will look, let you speak. Let I'll let you explain for I so long. Will, and you still are beating it on the bush. I'm sorry. I'm just, I will just want you to know if you want to really know. Yeah, but don't go into Jesus. Don't go into Romans. Speak to me why the Holy Spirit I knows. To, That's all I want, I want to know. I want to give you the understanding. Finish. I've that's got it. the understanding. No, no, no. That's why I'm If you can show me a verse where it says the Holy Spirit knows the hour, then I can you have a point. But right now, you haven't showed me a verse. You haven't showed me from your understanding. You have contradicted yourself without even realizing it. Are you finished? Now? Yes. Okay. If you read Romans, there's a verse. Okay. The, 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 uh, it's written. All, all will be safe. Okay. All. Okay. If you wait, wait, just wait. If you take the the the, 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 the this word all. Okay. In the same verse, in the same verse, this word is written two times. Okay. With two different explanation two different meanings this is what i'm saying get to the point the point is if you read a, uh, if you read the word you just know what is included or what is not included sometimes if you read all it's all humans sometimes if you read all only the jews where are you going with this i don't still don't understand i just want to are you using the word all now i'm giving you the understanding of words which word are you giving me the understanding words, words. no no which words which word are you giving me the explanation of because you're assuming i don't understand Certain words. Which word are you explaining right now? Please tell me. I'm explaining you the, the, the word father. Did I tell you I did not understand the word father? You don't understand it. Okay. I can, I can, I can, I can. So you're saying, okay, tell you do you know okay, tell me, I asked you this two times and you've already agreed the father is not the Holy Spirit. Did you not agree with that? The father is not the Holy Spirit. Do you agree or disagree? The father is not the Holy Spirit. The father is not the Holy Spirit. Do you agree Listen, or disagree? I said to you, the father is not the Holy Spirit. This Thank you. Thank you. Okay, good. Stop hey, that. I said to you, if you read, Father in the Holy uh, uh, in the New Testament, it's not always only the Father. It's sometimes. Sorry, sir. When you read when you re read the word what? The Father. Father. Okay. So when you read the Father, then what? It's not always the Father. It's not always just the Father. Because if you read Father, the Jews know you are speaking to God. Because. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Father is God. We already established that. There is one God which the Jews call Abba or Abba means the Father. I know Do, you know when Jesus tell to Mary Magdalene, I go to my Father and your Father, my God and your God. Yeah. Yes? Is Jesus saying he has a God? He's a God? Is Jesus telling Mary Magdalene he has a God or not? My God and your God. What does my God mean? Jesus says to Mary Magdalene, my God and your God. Yeah. Does Jesus have a God? Jesus is God. No, does Jesus have a God? No, he is God. So you're saying Jesus is telling a lie when he says, I go to my God and your God. No, he, what is my, no? He's not telling lie, no. Open the Bible, I'll show you where it is. It's not you lie. never heard this verse before. I go to my father and your father, my God and your and God. I said it's not a lie. What do you want me to So when Jesus says, my God, what do you understand? I, I said to you, Jesus is the servant here on earth. No, no, no. You see, you're, 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 you, you you're no. doing it again. What does the word my God mean? My God means that he is obeying I said to you. He came as flesh. He himself came as flesh. He's not here to show his might. He's not here to show his... What does the word my God mean? God's will. I already said to you. No, you didn't. Okay, what does the word your God mean? My God. No, your God. To Mary Magdalene. Your God. Yes. It's your God. So when he says your God, does it mean the God of Mary Magdalene? Jesus. Is that right? When Jesus says, look, Jesus... When I'm saying your God... No, no. I, I, I think you missed the point. Let me start again. Jesus is having a conversation with Mary Magdalene. Are we, are we understanding so far? I'm listening. Good. Jesus is speaking to whom? 
Speak, make your point, make your The point is this, Jesus speaking to whom? To Mary Magdalene, yes? When he says to Mary Magdalene, I go to my father and your father. Does Jesus have a father? It's a question to you now. Good, see, you didn't hesitate there. Very quickly you answered, yes, he has a father. Now the next statement. When Jesus says the next statement to her, my God and your God. So your God, we understand, is the God of Mary Magdalene. What does my God mean? That's a question to you now. Yes. Okay. Listen. Because Jesus said, your will okay. You're speaking about Jesus, right? No. Okay. Yeah. Jesus, son of God. No, God's will. Yeah. Jesus is the son of God. Okay. Yeah. Okay. The son of God. Yeah. Son so of God. Fall, so they fall. That means he's a uh, biological son. He said, okay. Your that doesn't mean he's a biological son. Good. Okay. Just to make, make that clear. Because I know. Um, are you, are you, are you uh, Muslim? Yes, I'm. Okay. Alhamdulillah. I know the Quran says. Uh, Can we not change the topic? Sorry? I just asked you, is my God mean? You see, you didn't hesitate earlier. When he says, my father, you immediately said yes. Why did you not go about that? Do you that? answer or do you want to? No, but you answer. Why are you going to the Quran now? This verse is in the Bible. No, I just want to explain you. No, but just say what my, my God means in this statement. That's all I'm asking you. Don't beat that about the bish. Can you do it in a specific answer to the specific question? If you, if you just keep quiet and let me answer. I, I did keep quiet, but you went to the Quran unnecessarily. Is it problem for you to uh, if I... Not in this context. Why? Is but the context is not about the Quran. So what you're doing is you're wasting time by going to the Quran. I give you understanding because you don't have the other... So which part of you thinks that I don't understand what my God means in that, in that statement. To me, my God there is clearly Jesus saying that he has a God. Just like he said, my father, which clearly shows that he has a father, a metaphoric one. I'm, I'm telling you that Jesus is a servant. Jesus is a servant. Whose servant is he? Servant of the Father. Sorry, servant of? Of the Father. Why did you not say God? Me? Why did you not say Jesus is a servant of God? Because he is God. So if he's God, why does he have a father? Uh -oh. This is what I'm saying to you. This does, is what I'm saying. Does God have a father? This is what I'm saying. No, no, does God have a father? God? Yes. God himself. Yes. God is God. He don't need a father. No. Exactly. But you're saying Jesus has a father. This is what I'm saying to you. This what? is why I give you the understanding. Just let me speak. This is why I, I gave you that chance to speak. I said Come to on. you, son of God. Yes. It's not biological. Thank you. Okay? Good. So what this, kind of son is no, it? No, no, let me speak. Let me speak. No, but I don't understand. No, no, no. Let me speak. Good, no, go on. No, no, I need to understand. What's not a question. You, you need to answer that. Okay, I, I listen. Go on. I said to you, son of God. Okay. It's, it's not, not biological. biological. Yes. Right. No so one. if you ask me, does God has a father? It's, it's not logical. Okay. Why? It's perfectly because logical. He's God. You don't need the father. He's God. Ah. It's not like. It's, it's not like us. So it's God human. doesn't have a Let father. Me speak. He's not like us. Okay, okay. Good. He's not human. Okay. If you read, um, son of God. Okay. It, um, Did he just say Jesus is not human? Oh, oh God is, did he just say that? Okay. Make up your mind, is he human or not? The original Allah. Oh, oh, I just want to speak. I need to understand what he's saying. When you make mistakes, you need to understand. that's why I'm asking you. Let me speak. Give okay, God. I'll give you, let you speak one minute and then I'll ask you the question. Very good. good. One minute. Okay. Yes. Okay. If you read Son of God, okay, it's not biological. Jesus himself, he is God. Okay. Um, God also says to Israel, this is firstborn son. We Christians, we, all, uh, we, we read in the Bible, Jesus is the firstborn son. Okay? So it's not biological. We know it's the relationship. Okay? When God Himself came to flesh, uh, came, came as flesh, it's not that He's gone when He is. He's still there. Okay? He's still there. But He came as Jesus. And Jesus um, on earth, He's just showing that He's a servant to the, to, to the Father. Okay? It's not, uh, it's not that he's a smaller, smaller God. He's the same. He's the same. This is what, um, but he, he, he's just showing us. He's showing us how to live here on earth, okay, and what to do. Is it generic to God? And he, he himself, is teaching the others that he's God. You know what I'm saying? Arabic Christian, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I know. But you still haven't answered the question. What does my God mean? 
Exactly. That was the question. Did you, did you forget the question? This, this was, this was my, if you don't understand it. Read that bit. From here, Jesus said. So you understand it. Verse 17. John chapter 20, verse 17. Read it. Read it aloud so we can all hear, if you don't mind. You can read it. What? No, but I want you to, I've already read it. Okay, read it aloud for the benefit of everyone. Just, just listen to it. Aloud, if you don't mind, yeah? Yes, yes. Do you see the word my God in there? It's like cherry picking. That's all I want to know what it means. This is what, I, what, this is what, what does the word my God mean in there? Difference. Jesus says my God. Yeah. What does my God mean? My God is God. Okay. Does he have a God? Does Jesus have a God? Yes or no? Jesus is God. That wasn't my question if Jesus is God or not. The question is does Jesus have a God? Jesus himself is That wasn't God. my question. So you don't need Look, a God. I didn't ask if Jesus is God or not. Yeah. The question is when Jesus says my God, what do you understand? You know, you know, just I understand. That look, 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 look. Be sincere with me. Yes. By the way, if maybe you can answer this question. When Jesus says I go to my God and your God. What does the word my God mean? He's referring to himself. So you. This what I'm so whoa, 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 whoa. So, so basically, when he says my God, yes. When, when you say my, my wait a minute. When he says my God, how can it be? He didn't say myself. I go to my God. How can he go to himself? Can Jesus go to himself? How? He How can he go? God, he is God. That wasn't the question. Of course. The question is, is Jesus, does Jesus have a God? No, he is God. Okay, is. so Jesus was telling lies when he says, my God. No, yes. this is the understanding. Speaking to himself. You speak to himself. No, he was speaking to Mary Magdalene. You're wrong. He's speaking to Mary Magdalene. He's speaking to Mary Magdalene. Who is he speaking to? Your soul speaks to your body. Your mind speaks to your Who is Jesus speaking to here? Your mind controls your body. Okay, what is, okay, what does my father mean? Watch this now. What does my father mean? When Jesus says, I go to my father and your father. Yeah. No, no, my father. Just my father. What does it mean? Do you know what Jesus said? Um, when she, when she, when Can I ask you something? He said, No, you had a chance. No. What does my father mean? Jesus said, What father, does. Jesus said, Father, glorify me. No, that wasn't a question. What does my father, I go to my father and your father Why mean? Is the father glorifying Jesus. Because they're the same person. Hold on. Did you understand the question? There's your answer. Did you understand the question? I, I, yeah. Okay, what is my question? That's the point. You don't listen. The question you're interrupting, listen to the question this time, please. Okay? And I don't mean that in a bad way. I want you to understand the question. That's all. Yeah. When Jesus spoke to Mary Magdalene and he says to her, Do not hold on to me, for I have not yet ascended to the Father. We understand so far, yes? Yeah. Why did Jesus don't did not want Mary Magdalene to hold on to Jesus? Because he had to the Father. Thank you very much. So what's the next the point the next point is this: when Jesus says, Go instead to my brothers and tell them I'm ascending to my father and your father. What does my father mean there? This is himself. No, no. He's God. No, no. When he says my father, are you saying God was glorified? Are you saying Je God was glorified? God is so glorious. It's not about glory. There's no mention. There's no word glory in there. God can come down to earth and glorify him. I didn't ask you what. No preaching, no I didn't ask you who glorified him. No preaching. Okay. Did I ask you who glorified him? He said glorify okay. me before the world was. Okay. But the Old Testament says um, that God shares his glory with no man. Okay. So when why you, is God sharing glory? When he says, when he's, he's the same person. Hold on. When he says, when he says my father. In the name of the Father. Hold on. And of the Son. Okay. And of the Holy Ghost. What? What does your father mean then? It's as simple as that. No, no, your father. What does your father mean? Myself, my myself. What you, wait, wait, wait. What, is, <laughs> what does your father mean here? You've asked about five times now. No, I haven't asked about your... I asked about my father. Yeah. What does your father mean here? Okay, I'm saying for the third time now. My God. No, no, your father. Your father. What does it mean? Your God. Who, who is your? Are you guys coming? He, he, he's got... Oh, 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 oh. Who is your? He's God. No, no, your... Who is your here? the same person. Oh, my God. He doesn't understand it. That's the problem. I do explain it to you. Do you understand that? Your father. What does your father mean? Your God. What do you where, where, where? There, your father and my father. Okay, so what does your father mean? Can I ask you about God? Okay, so your father means God. And who is your ear? Go to the brothers. He says, go instead to my brothers. It means brothers in faith, yes? And tell them, I'm ascending to my father and your father. Does Jesus have the same father as his brethren? It's the same. He, he, it's the same. It's okay, the same. so they both have the same father. Do you agree? It's the same, yeah. The metaphorical father, obviously, yes? 
Do they both have the same father? Good? We are good so far? I said, I said. Are we good so far? Okay, go on. You want to say something? Go on. If you read father, I told you more than 10 times. It's God. Okay? It's God. Okay, here. Yeah. Do you understand it so far? I'm explaining to you. Do you understand it so far? The father is God. Abba? Do you understand? I'm answering if you let me. You have no, because I'm answering. Do you we've answer then? Do you understand that we've explained the father is God? Are you answering or asking? I'm, I'm asking you. Thank you. you so let me answer. Do you understand? Will you let me answer? Good. In this context, when he says, go to my father and your father, I agree that is God. Good. Now the next question. Remember, my father and your father. So the father shared by Jesus is the same father as those of his brothers. Do you agree? The same God, basically. The say same God. Again, say again, say again. My father and your father. We are talking about the same father, which is according to you guys a God. I have no problem with that. God, yeah. Good. Next question. When he says, I go, I am ascending to my father and your father, to my God and your God. So basically, do you agree that they both have the same God just like they both have the same Father? I said to you, Jesus is God. He that wasn't the question. You see what I mean? This is the question. You're asking Jesus us. Have I have told did you. I ask you, Jesus God? You asked me. Did I ask you, Jesus God? You asked me, Jesus. <laughs> does, uh, I Jesus God. The name. I didn't ask you, Jesus God. I asked you, does the, the brothers name. of Jesus, the brothers in faith, do, does God. Jesus, wait, does Jesus and his brothers in faith have the same God? Yes. 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 Thank you. So that means Jesus has a God. So, so I respect it. Yes. Okay, I think we have done it now. I think we have done it.